How's it going everybody gaming bear here? I hope your morning, day, night, or whenever you're watching this video has been absolutely phenomenal thus far. We are back with our quarterback, Clemson Tiger Hunter Hall, and I am very happy with the change. Hopefully, like I mentioned in the last video, hopefully you guys are as well for what we are going to be able to do. I will have career stats underneath our season stats for you guys, just because of course, the last two seasons of us being a running back, is technically forgotten but never forgotten if that makes any sense at all you always want to remember what you've done in the past especially when you are looking to get into the nfl i know we're currently a quarterback but when it comes to the nfl resume any coach and team look to see what we have done and not specifically what we're doing unless we're also being phenomenal at the quarterback position our week one game against the florida gators we unfortunately lost so we already tied for the worst or best season that we've had throughout the three seasons now that we are currently on and uh this time we're starting off a little bit better throwing a touchdown to start it so i'm very happy with that rogers our fastest and youngest player on the offensive side of the ball with this tigers team and uh, I'm hoping he can kind of step up and just be a complete speedster and uh, create some humongous plays for me in this quarterback position as we get our arm strength higher and his speed can actually make a difference. And Wrencher doing a phenomenal job punching himself into the end zone. He saw the tight end, went ahead and got down the field and chipped the safety to catapult Wrencher into the end zone which of course is very nice to see teammates helping each other out and now the curse of Madden 20 when it comes to scrambling quarterbacks the regardless of having 98 carrying and all of our running back attributes of being a 99 overall running back despite you know being in the actual quarterback position has no effect whatsoever as we get baby touched and we fumble the ball and now you see wrencher busting off a humongous 75 yard rushing touchdown that gets negated due to a holding penalty and to make it even worse we were a little bit annoyed by that for Wrencher through our Hunter Hall, and we throw an interception. The very following play was just added insult to injury, and now we are just self-destructing at this point. We have two turnovers, and we are only in the first half. We have had no more than two turnovers throughout any game, and that's two full seasons. So we are desperately going to have to figure out a way to secure this ball more, which I know is just a Madden 20 thing and you barely have to get touched to cough up the ball and it's extremely aggravating as we throw another interception. Still down by four points. I'm happy the defense stood strong and actually got a turnover of their own. And now the 99 running back that we were coming into play, bulldozing the man who intercepted us prior number 23 to get into the end zone. So a little bit of man-on-man uh, -man action to show that we are the more dominant of the two uh, more so evening out with uh, what has actually happened you see that the Sooners go ahead and take the lead up until Overton up the seam DB misses and into the end zone with 44 seconds left and then our defense goes ahead and gets another interception and of course you see Rancher, last run of the day to get rid of their final timeout. We win, so we start off 1-1 one one on the season, but today, better and worse, depending on how you want to put it. We had 235 passing yards, 79 rushing yards. We also had two fumbles, so we're not even going to keep track of these fumbles or our broken tackles when it comes to our career stats. We're just going to add the carries and the yards in terms of rushing and then all of the statistics through being an actual quarterback. So, like I said, we're not going to overly filter with all these stupid fumbles that we're going to have just because it's Madden 20 and 
By doing so, we're also not going to be adding the broken tackles just to kind of in flux and make that look better just throughout the season. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to let me know down in the comment section and by that thumbs up, much appreciated. And until next time, everybody, Gaming Bear out.